Hello YouTube, Tim Kubron here, and uh, today I will be beginning a Let's Play of XCOM 2, uh, going all the way through from the beginning to the end, and uh, sharing my adventure with you guys. Alright, let's start this up. Um, gonna play on Veteran, I think. I am uh, familiar with XCOM, but I don't want to... Uh, you know, play on these difficulties and end up looking like a total, uh, you know, like a total noob in front of all you guys. Uh, I don't really need the tutorials. Uh, Iron Man. Uh, yeah, you know, I mean, this is a playthrough that I'm gonna be posting up on uh, YouTube. Sure, let's let's go with Iron Man. And uh, DLC here. Yeah, sure. Let's uh, let's enable it. Let's go. So for any of you who didn't play XCOM Enemy Unknown or uh, this one XCOM 2, uh, the first one XCOM Enemy Unknown, uh, aliens invaded and uh, the XCOM administration was uh, founded to uh, fight them off to repel the aliens. Um, this game XCOM 2 is actually based like I think 20 years in the future of XCOM Enemy Unknown and uh, starts off with the assumption that the player in Enemy Unknown failed and uh, the aliens took over Earth. So here in XCOM 2, uh, the aliens are the superpower, they have formed the advent. Uh, and uh, XCOM is now like a fringe element, just kind of doing whatever they can, hit and run tactics to sort of survive still trying to fight them off but uh, again they're not the power that they were in enemy on all citizens that today's celebrations will continue as planned perfect the advent administration reminds you to report all suspicious activity Approaching position. You were right. Definitely got their hands full today. Stay focused. Prep gate crasher. Sixty seconds. learn that we can hit them where it hurts. So we're moving into the city center to strike a high-profile target. Deploy and approach the designated position. Neutralize any hostile contacts and secure the site. All right, sounds good. Okay, here we go. Menace one five. We have a fix on the target. Move to place the X four charges at the designated position. Roger that. 
Okay, let's see if I can remember how to play this game. It's, uh... <laughs> it's been a little while. Uh... Let's have you go up here first. These guys okay. make up the bulk of the advent forces we've dealt with. They're disciplined and well-equipped, but their obedience makes them predictable. Alright, them's, uh... Gotta watch out for them. Running. And uh, we'll have you go over here. Go, go, go. Don't want to uh, step on these red tiles just yet. Uh, that will alert the enemy and I'll uh, lose my element of surprise. Olivia. Moving to designated position. See, they're just casually walking along. They don't know nothing's going on. Man. They're uh, pretty bunched up. I wonder if we could get them all with Roger one that. grenade. Menace one five. You're near the target position. one square away. Okay, maybe I can get someone else a little bit closer. Hitting there now. Okay, are you close enough? Yes. Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. Well, here we go. <laughs> They're on to us. Headed there now. All right, let's bring the rest of them up here. Moving out. Got it. Confirmed. Thought there were supposed to be, uh... Oh, there they are. The Advent officers seem more capable than the grunts. We're not sure whether to chalk it up to training or to switch to mind control. Yeah, that would have been way too easy, just the three of them like that. Alright, so let's see what I got. You're in range to throw a grenade at. So, heck, let's do it. Early on, I mean, your guys, uh, your troops have no aiming ability. They're just terrible. So, you know, the grenades with the guaranteed kill there is just like, heck, why, you know, why wouldn't you do it sometimes? You know, you could shoot and get like a 25%, or you could throw a grenade and just be done with it. Uh, over here, this person is being flanked, so I have a better shot at them. Here we go. Let's try it. Very nice and a critical. Oh Enemy man, the guy never even stood a chance. What do we got here? All right, can I hit this last dude with a grenade? Not quite. Okay. Um. In that case, I might just. Let's let's put him in Overwatch this time. Overwatch. See what happens. Move this guy up. 
and put him in Overwatch too. He can't do anything else right now. All right, so this guy moves up. Overwatch shot. Nope, not quite. That's all right. That's all right. Yeah, I didn't get it. He shoots, and he misses. Not even close. They're all over me. You know what are you aiming at? Come on. All right, so with that, I believe that is going to put an end to this mission pretty quick. He uh, let me have my turn okay. again. I'm just going to, you know, move this guy over here just for no reason in particular. And I'm going to throw my grenade. And with that, boom. No more bad guys. The area is secure. We're not picking up any inbound contacts. Scanners Score. are clear. Minus one five, we have a limited window to act before Advent responds. We need to get those charges planted on the double. All right, fine. Let's uh, plant them charges and uh, we'll call it a successful mission. Minus one five, rendezvous at the extraction point. Status confirmed. Squad is huh. clear. Detonating charge. I guess. Uh, if uh, there are no enemies left, you don't have a rendezvous, you just kind of auto-do it. That's that's useful. And look at that, a flawless first mission. Absolutely nothing went wrong. That was beautiful. Couldn't ask for anything better. Now here, with um, these stats here, I never quite understood them. They're, they're fun for a little while. But, like, after a couple missions, you're just like, eh, whatever, you know, what's what's the point? So, I, I, don't, I don't know, I never really got that. Whatever. made it back whole and the aliens paid the price great work commander oh yeah oh yeah you know it absolutely nobody even hurt and let's see i pick up a uh, repeater five percent chance to instantly kill the target when hit regardless of the target's remaining hp okay got some trooper corpses and an officer corpse all right commander to the research labs all right, uh, I guess I'm going to call it a day there. Uh, I'll, you know, distribute the uh, promotions and do the research lab stuff next time. And, uh, yeah, I hope you guys, uh, hope you enjoyed it. Have a good day and uh, peace.